sign saying that uh, Harry, the voice of Harry here, that's the heaven phone on the hotline. Harry, you're in the air. Hey, Harry. Kevin Mannix, hey, let hey, me hear you. Hey, 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 uh, Harry, Jim is now a Cub fan. Yeah, that's what I heard. You know, I just want to say there's nothing in life worse than a fair weather monkey. Ah, uh, so what? You know what? You tell me everybody at Wrigley, about 90% of the people from out of town, they don't give a shit about baseball or cup. Yeah, but they buy an expensive ticket and, they, and drink beer, man, Bob's beer. That's what it's all about. pay the exorbitant, where's your hot dog? Yeah. They'll pay the exorbitant concession prices. Mm -hmm. And uh, the ballpark was the main draw besides your Truly, for years. Now, sure, there might be a young chick or two with a nice ass and some nice tits and the bleachers. Maybe they enjoyed <laughs> looking at Rhino Sandberg or Mark Grace's butt. Yeah. As you used to hear. Not yours. No, Rhino's But back. still, yeah. they made money. and But now, it's going to be both. And they'll be coming out of the woodwork like termites, James. Mm -hmm. And I'm disappointed in you, not because you finally have seen the light, but because you were so negative last year. No, it's because... Why I, were you such a mopey son of a bitch? Because I put... You sullen cox... I, I put it, I put in, I, I've got 500 that they win the World Series. That's all I care about. That's all. That's it. Was that with the guy in Harris? No, the that's... Rocko, uh, it's my Beaver Island Casino, Harry. Oh, 500, huh? Yeah. I think you could do better than that. What is Mannix paying you? What about an advance? Why don't you double it? I don't want to double it because the chances are they're going to fold like they always do, and I don't want to. 500 is enough. And what do you get if they once they win it? Because I have got some news for you, pal. This is the year. Yeah, sure. The meeting, we just wrapped up the deal. Jack Brickhouse was there. Lou Boudreau. We had Ernie. Ronnie Sano made a cameo, even. And then we brought in some of the old guys, the Cabarettas and the Pascos from the 45 and, uh, and the uh, deal, while the ink may not be dry, James, and it doesn't work like that anyway where I am, the word of mouth should be good. This is the year. Double your bet. And that's all I can say right. without me getting in serious trouble. I wanted to tell you about this broad the other day in Arizona. Oh, Jimmy. Who you should have seen. She had one of the, she was one of these blonde brunettes, you know, and she had those cutoffs. Remember the cutoffs? Mm -hmm. Remember the one night? Okay, this Harry, one. we'll give This you one had the, the, and she had that little, that space, as they talk about. It's, you know, leaning a bit between first and, hey, they caught him off first. first. Well, uh, they'll shade her over just a bit. Jimmy, I didn't take my medicine yet. I can tell. Yeah, I better go. Yeah, I'm looking at the Cubs and their spring training record. Yeah. I, yeah. I think they've only won one game. They're yeah. the worst. Yeah, right. Baseball. They are. They suck. <laughs> oh, God. Um, you uh, Kev heads, uh, hey, w enjoy the weekend. Thank you for the uh, the birthday messages. and mm -hmm. uh, Enjoy uh, the springtime. Uh, don't forget to set your clocks back. That's a pain in the ass. Yeah. Jim, what are you going to do? Uh, well, we got to get out of here. We need we need to go. <laughs> Do something. Too bad. We, you know, now I want to go to Riley's daughter. Now that we found out it's open again, yeah. I'd like to just. I maybe we should get in, call up Uber, mm -hmm. and drive over to Riley's daughter and just sit there and get drunk. Yeah. I mean, just stay there all day. Shit face. I miss the South Side, and it's going to yeah. be good to see you, Kevheads. Yep. On March twentieth, Sunday at uh, St. Rita's High School. Yeah. Uh, we're going to be there from 1 to 4, so come on out and say hi. But it'd be nice to just, you know, 
after the technical glitches. Yeah. But it, the yeah. studio's up and running, and what do you do? I mean, what do you do? I want to thank Steve Dahl. He's the man. Yeah.